everyone this is Gian Roberts and uh, welcome to another video uh, in this video I'm going to talk about how to get more out of life how to how did you really maximize uh, your time here uh, in this lifetime and uh, how to get the get what you want out of life um, so if you don't know me uh, my name is Gian Roberts I'm the author of the book retire younger and if you like what I'm talking about in this video I want you to go to retireyounger.us forward slash call and uh, download this book and uh, set up a free call with me to talk about the game plan that I have, uh, have put aside for you but I need to personalize it to you so that's why we need to get on the phone and make sure that you're a good fit and uh, that I'm giving you you know the information that you need personally uh, because each person's at a different point in their life and so I, I need to make sure that the, the information I give you is is correct and that you're in the right place alright so um, I had an interesting experience this morning and I wanted to share it with you and get you thinking about you know that uh, about your your term here on earth okay um, so this is my first time but um, this morning you know the roads were very wet and the water pooled up in the road and it was just above freezing so the roads were very slick and um, there was a car coming towards me and it was early in the morning so it was still dark out and there was a car coming towards me so I, I pushed on the brake a little bit and then my car decided to hydroplane um, and I thought for a moment that this was going to be it, right? This was going to be the end of my life, and um, so, so it, you know, how everything kind of flashes in front of you, and you just decide that uh, this is going to really hurt, or and if I survive this, um, this might be the last thought that I have. So, um, I don't know if you ever been in that situation, and I've been in that situation a few times in my life, where I thought, yeah, this is this is my last day. Right, this is my last time on Earth, and so I, I know that um, life is very precious, but life is very short, and um, and there's not a lot of time to 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 mess around, to put things off, and to you know kick the can down the road. If you're in that situation and you're you're tired of being stuck in your current situation and you want to move on to something different, something better and you uh, you have a lot to give to the world and you want to to express that and um, but you feel stuck in your economic situation and uh, or you are worried all the time that you don't have enough money to pay your bills and things like that or you're worried about not having money in your retirement or running out of money in your retirement which is which is you know you're not alone there's there's over you know four million people every year that are moving or transitioning into retirement and so that's a real concern and so no matter where you are in your life path um, whether you're you're in your 20s your 30s your 40s your 50s 60s 70s 80s 90s even a hundred um, there's still opportunities for you to to change the path that you're on or to improve your your circumstances so that um, you know you have less worry and you can get to do the things that you really want to do and so that's what my book is about and uh, and so I give you a system a, a path that a lot of people have followed in the past and uh, including people like Warren Buffett uh, Donald Trump um, uh, you know Branson and, and uh, many many very wealthy people they they followed this system exactly I'm going to give you the building blocks in this video and hopefully that you'll you'll jump on a call with me and uh, I can give you the full game plan personalized for you um, in an upcoming uh, time so I have some time set apart uh, so please give me a call or set up a time to call me at uh, retireyounger.us forward slash call all right, so let me jump to some slides here. And um, so, what is retiring younger? Retiring younger is not an age and it's not a number. Retiring younger is not not having a million dollars in the bank. And retiring younger is not, you know, when you reach age 65 or 70. 
it's not a number. It, you can retire at any point. And what retiring means to me, what to retire younger means to me is, is when your passive income either equals or surpasses your active income. So most of our our lives have been pursuing this active income. I'm sorry, I have to sneeze. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sorry about that. Um, so we've been pursuing this active income. You know, we, we go to work or we have a business that we have to be at every single day in order to make an income, right? And so there are ways where you can build a passive income, income that, that comes in, you build it once, and then the money comes in month after month after month. So the only way to do that is to build, is to get a real asset. Right, and so when your passive income is equal to or surpasses your active income, what that allows you to do is to, to have the time freedom to do the things that you wanted to do with the people that you wanted to do it with, whenever you want to do it. Right, and so you, and plus you don't have the worry of you know how how are your bills going to be paid every single month. Like I said, um, for example, you know people like Warren Buffett who who's a billionaire, he has assets and he has income coming in from that asset right every single month so if you took all the money out of his bank account and uh, just just you know just gave it away um, Warren Buffett wouldn't be worried because his passive income the next month would pay for all his bills and give him the lifestyle that, that he currently has right so that's that's the type of income that you need to generate for yourself and so I have a system that I outlined in the book retire younger that uh, it allows you to to build this passive income and uh, it shows you the benefits of having a cash flow retirement as opposed to you know the nest egg theory where you save up a bunch of money for 40 years and then you live off the the savings and uh, what happens when that savings runs out because the average person lives 20 years in retirement so now you gotta divide whatever you saved up by 20 years and then eventually you might run out of money in your old old age right all right so that plan doesn't work it has never worked and so I, I'm giving you an alternative here called the cash flow retirement income so these three gentlemen on the screen that you see right now um, are all retired right they, uh, Brian Elwood retired at age 30 uh, Chris Crone retired at age 26 and Dan Locke uh, retired at age 26 as well so how did they do it? They did it by generating a passive income to replace their active income. All right. So I'm going to give you on the next slide. I'm going to give you different examples of these passive income sources. Right. Something that you set up once and then it keeps paying you month after month, year after year. And uh, how you can set this up for yourself, even if you have very little money to get started with. Or if you have some seed capital, that's going to allow you to, to move a little faster and get down, down the road a little bit faster and, and start generating bigger sums of passive income. Okay, so, all right, so here's the, uh, the, the three stages that you need to go through in order to make this happen for you, right? How, how, how can you achieve this early retirement that I'm talking about in this video? And, and remember that you know, I started this video talking about how life is very, very short. So we're talking about three to five years of, of con continuous effort on your part to make this happen for you. So you move through these three stages, and at the end of that three stages, you'll have that passive income to replace your active income. Um, now, there's different ways and methods uh, to get there, So, um, but it follows these three stages, uh, you know, in in kind of a sequence. All right. So the first thing is you have to have a real reason why you want to do something. Otherwise, you're going to get stopped at your first obstacle, right? You're not going to be able to move through some of the resistance that you're going to find when you're you're building uh, um, this type of passive income, right? So there's some things, some obstacles that you will face, and uh, and so that's why I like to partner with the people that uh, go through my program so so that you know we're doing it together and we can push through obstacles and we can get 
you know mentorship along the way so you're not in in, in this alone and uh, we have a group a community of people that are like-minded and will help you through basically any situation but you have to provide the reason why you want to do this and I'm going to give you a tool in the next slide that shows you exactly uh, how to how to start this this process and how to to generate a, a strong will or strong reason why you want to get this uh, to achieve this goal alright so the second step is either to uh, to build or to acquire right passive cash flow investments so what's, what's a passive cash flow investment well these are obviously something that's going to generate monthly profits right and you're going to receive those profits in the form of payments alright so royalties is, is one type of uh, method where you can set something up once and then you get re royalties monthly royalties or yearly royalties on something that you set up so example would be like a youtuber who sets up a bunch of videos on youtube and then you know builds up traffic to those videos and then the advertisers pay them you know to advertise on their videos because they're getting video views so that's one form of ro royalties you can do affiliate marketing where you sell a product and it's a monthly recurring product um, you can develop your own product or membership site and uh, this is another recurring uh, revenue you can uh, do these online uh, lending clubs where you can lend uh, to individuals and get return on your investment that way um, and, uh, and then th another thing that cash flows is cash flow real estate these these are usually single-family residents that, that you purchase um, and you can use either your own money or somebody else's capital to purchase these properties and then um, you know pay that back over time and you make a profit you have the profit margin built into it through the monthly lease or the monthly rental income that comes in and so we show you how to do that I can show you how to do that um, you can buy r r mortgage notes or real estate notes right so every time uh, a piece of real estate is purchased and the uh, the person doesn't have all the cash to purchase 100 percent of that property a note is created a IOU uh, promise to pay uh, is created and uh, usually we call these mortgage notes or deed tr trust deeds right and so uh, you can buy these notes and they're, they're secured by real estate and so that person you know uh, has an obligation to pay that that monthly payment and you can buy these monthly payments in the form of the note and you can buy these at, at bigger discounts than you can actually buy the actual real estate um, so uh, you can get a bigger profit margin if you buy the note and so we can I can definitely show you how to do that as well now another thing that cash flows is businesses right so businesses naturally generate profits that's why people go into businesses to generate profits so I don't recommend that you buy a startup but you buy an existing business that's been in business for at least 10 years and the the owner has decided to move on to something else or they decided to move into retirement so either way uh, they have an existing business and the business is doing well cash flowing you can make some improvements so it cash flows and, and gets more profit and uh, so as the owner you can hire a manager to manage the business and uh, make sure that it's just running well and then it's a 100 percent passive on your part if you have everybody else running the business right so that's one way so this is called m and a or mergers and acquisitions so i can definitely show you how to do that as well so step three is to take the profits from from this stage right take the profits and take it and move it into a cash flow investment or to automate this process so that you're you're gaining more cash flow investments and growing that monthly residual income or passive income um, so you can do this through automation through outsourcing through um, uh, what's the word uh, syndication you can syndicate this right and so you can use other people's time and other people's money that's what OPM and OPT means right so we can show you how you can do this and maximize it so that 
each month your your passive income is growing by month by month by month and year by year and so uh, this allows you to to grow your business and to know that you'll never run out of cash because it's growing every month and you have you'll help be diversified in the marketplace all right so that's just a, a quick overview of the three stages there's obviously a lot more detail that I need to go over with you and so what I want you to do is set up a call with me so that I can give you a game plan on where to get started and how to, to get moving on this on this path of a cash flow retirement okay so to do that you go to retireyounger.us forward slash call all right and uh, so the first stage was the reason why so uh, the biggest uh, thing that you can do right now is to write uh, a letter to yourself that, that outlines the ideal day. What is your emotional state in this ideal day? How do you feel? Where are you? Wh what are you doing? Um, what what are some of the things that you've always wanted to do and you you never had the time to do them or the the resources to do them? So write these down into a, a letter to yourself, and what you're going to do is make it very very clear of what you want. Okay, that's that's the idea. It's like what do you want in life and what do you want to get out of it? What's important to you? Who are the people that you want to interact with on a daily basis? You know, uh, for me, it's like uh, I want to spend more time with my parents. I want to spend more time with my children, and, and, and be able to take the time, you know, where I'm not working, and, and to, to actually spend time with with them when they need me. Okay, so that's that's an important distinction in my plan, but your plan might be different. So you're going to customize it to yourself, and then you're going to read this every single day. So put it in a spot where you can pick it up and read it to you every day. That's going to give you an instant reminder. Now another thing that you should do every day is go to YouTube and listen to Jim Rohn. Um, his last name is R O H N. All right, Jim Rohn, and listen to some of his uh, personal development um, speeches, and uh, and that will get you in the right mind for mindset uh, to to start your day and give you a mental image of, of what your goal is. So when you're going through the day and you're making decisions, you'll have a clear objective of where you want to go and that will, will lead you down the straight and narrow path that you need to, to stay on in order to make retiring younger a, an achievable goal. So here's another process that you can implement in order to make sure that you achieve your goals. So it's called GPS or Goal Process and Schedule. Uh, I learned this uh, from my mentor Brian Elwood and uh, in this uh, it, it's a one, one page document and uh, that you review on a daily basis and basically uh, at the top it has your vision statement that you set for that particular year so it's a 12 month vision statement so this is what I want to achieve in 12 months and then put it the date December 31st 2019 or 2020 or whenever you're seeing this video um, and then your daily income goals you want to make this a stretch for you so if you're making so much money now per day you know double that or put an extra zero on it whatever it is but make it a, a, a stretch for you so that uh, you can always have that reminder this is my income goals and the way you come up with a daily income goal another way that you can do it is figure out how much you want to make per year and then reverse engineer that to, to uh, you know one day of income right so and then you have your monthly milestones these are you know your income goals your the number of people that you talk to that month uh, you know those type of things um, are monthly milestones and then you want to set three major goals for each month right three major goals that you're going to work on a daily basis to achieve that particular month and uh, when you achieve that goal then you can cross it off your list and add another goal so you just want three of them though so so you can focus on, on just achieving these three things this is going to keep you from from wildly going in different directions you should focus in three areas okay 
So then you want to set up a step-by-step -step process for each, achieving each goal for that particular month, right? And then you're going to schedule that. And so I'm going to show you that in the next slide. But this is what it'll look like. It's just a one-page document. It has your vision statement, your your daily income goal, your your monthly goals, and then it's going to have your step-by-step -step processes below. And so what you do is you take your processes and you break it down per day. So you just set, set up a Trillo board, and uh, in Trillo you can uh, go Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and then you take your three goals and you put a time frame for those goals. Let's say it's an hour each day, right? So you have one goal, and then inside these these cards you'll have a checklist where you can check off the tasks that you need to do on that goal that particular day. So this is how you reverse engineer it. You figure out what you want to achieve that, that year and then you break it down per month and then you break it down per day and then you break it down per task. Okay, And so this is going to allow you, you know that you're on the right track, that you're, you're following this path if you do this every single day and you make yourself do it. Alright, so that's, that's the end of the slides and uh, so again, um, if you're interested in what I just just talked about and if this this idea of retiring younger is is interesting to you and you want to learn how to do this in the next three to five years and, and you want to learn how to to leverage other people's time and money to make it happen for you right somebody else can be paying for your retirement uh, that's basically what I'm saying um, if you want to learn how to do that then go ahead and get a copy of my book by going to retireyounger.us forward slash call and uh, set up a call with me, download the free copy of my book, read through it. There's also a planning guide on there that uh, I'm going to go over with you on the phone. So go ahead and download that, print that out, and then on the phone I can go over and, and you can fill in the blanks um, on the planning guide to uh, have a customized plan for you. And uh, there's nothing for sale on this call. It's totally free. Uh, if you want to continue on with, with more training, I definitely have that available to those who, uh, who, who want to pursue it further. But uh, you'll leave the phone call with a clear picture of, of how to achieve this goal of retiring younger and how you can do it uh, in your own personal life with your own situations. And uh, and make it happen. Uh, that's the the main thing. And also, you'll you'll have the opportunity to join our community as well. So, I hope this was uh, helpful and informative for you. And uh, again, uh, I'll be talking to you soon. Just go to retireyounger.us forward slash call. And again, there's no sales pitch or nothing to buy. All right. So we'll talk to you soon. Bye.